Why won't you die? What's up? Chris here, and we are about to have some fun. So over the past few years, I've been unintentionally stress testing my VR equipment and myself. But seeing how fun actual torture test videos look, I decided, yeah, I'm gonna do that. And what better headset to sacrifice in the index? It's still extremely popular. I already know it could take a beating, and you could find one secondhand for an absolute still right now. But is a used headset really gonna last? Well... All right, so here we are upstairs, and this is going to be the apparatus used for the first test. Now, if you've watched VR content before, you may very well have seen the drawing machine standardized durability testing methodology on Thrill Seeker's channel, but although he has pioneered this technique, I am pushing the limits even further by placing a GoPro on the inside so we can see the action like it's never been seen before by man. actually making so much noise. Where did the GoPros lose? Oh, you lost the GoPro. So here we are after a few minutes in the dryer and besides some newly formed scuffs and the front being dirty as hell, it seemed to have survived. Um, as you can see, it's tracking and everything, which is good. Uh, just imagine if it had completely broken. That would have been a sad short video, but um, it did survive. Uh, on to some more tests. Now, if you've owned a VR headset, you've probably seen the warning that says, do not use outside. Now, this is not because it'll instantly self-destruct like people seem to believe, but it's because if sunlight hits the lenses, it'll magnify and can melt your screen. So how long that'll take, who knows? So go ahead and put your guesses down in the comments and we'll find out right now. All right, so check this out. As you can see, it's a bright, sunshiny day. That's why I have full protection on because I am a creature of the night. Um, I've gone ahead and taped up the right lens so we only burn the left lens and the sun is... <laughs> What Mississippi? All right, so that 100% did nothing, but we'll go to the house and we'll check it out. Well, to my surprise, that one second actually did cause damage. It's hard to see, but this one little burn pixel was not there before. So I went out again and cooked it for five seconds. The damage was in fact five times as bad. Um, I did it again for 20 seconds and the damage was even more substantial. And if that wasn't enough, I went out to touch grass one last time and let it fry for over a minute. And this was the result. Holy shit yeah this thing is absolutely foobard so i guess it's safe to say that no amount of sun exposure is good so be extra careful when transporting these around outside because sure All right, so that once again ended up being more of an impact test than anything. As you can see, this part broke off right here. Um, this thing, I didn't even realize that was missing until I got back. We had this part tear up, but the spring in here still works. And I don't know if you can hear that, the music, but both the speakers are still working. This little, little uh, wire stayed intact. And nothing little tape can't fix. And besides that, we're going strong. Oh, God! Ah, oh, that actually hurt! Ah, oh, my forehead! Ah! Oh. Oh. <laughs> my bad, hero only accepts cold hard cash. What is this? Oh. I'm so sorry. <laughs> a new trick I've been working on? Uh, yeah, no, sure, why no. not? No, 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 no. Alright, check this out. Oh, is he okay? Dying. Is he okay? I have though? that skin, by the way. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Anyways. 
Hello? I have some bananas <gasps> that I could give you. The rookie mistake yesterday was a matter. Yo, what the hell? What did you just call my imaginary girl? No, 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 babe, step back, step back. I got this, I got this. You think because you're tall and handsome, you can roll up here and just say whatever you want to anyone's imaginary girlfriend? Whatever, bozo. <laughs> what? What are you just calling me? Sorry, look at What is this? I to my face. All right, so I have no idea how, but this ground is cement. He's literally been surviving all of it. So what we're gonna do is take him to the top, drop him, oh God, I can't pull this up with him here. Drop him flat onto his head, because if it survives this, then honestly, it's just gonna survive everything, I guess. What the hell? Bro, no, oh my God, that was so uneventful, what the? All right, let's try this again. Oh, is it? It's still working. What? Dude, this thing's invincible. All right, so a little damage assessment and things aren't looking too good, but somehow it's still functioning. But uh, I think I'm more impressed by the fact that this Gorilla Tape has been actually holding this strap on this entire time. Like what? It has not survived the great milkening. Everything but milk, apparently. All right, so I don't know why, but this was the most requested thing, and I don't see how this is even a legitimate test unless you're planning on playing in the fucking pits of Mordor or something, but look, there you go. She's in the oven. You happy? You want me to stick her in my George Foreman grill next or something? Psh. All right, let's see what happens, though. Index fumes. Don't breathe those. I believe that the strap is beginning to melt. All right, let's see. She's looking good and done. And oh my God, dude, that looks... That doesn't look good. All right, so check this out. This thing was broken from the milk. I had to remove the entire front plate to get this plugged in, but look, it's working again. What the hell? What is this thing made out of? Why won't you die? Just die already. I could probably drop it. I could pick it right back up again. It never stops working! It's invincible! Invincible! Now that's a good melon. <laughs> Fatality. Yo, the melon escaped. I'm gonna take this home and eat it. Alrighty, so I'm no expert, but I'm gonna go out on a limb and assume that this thing is not gonna work, probably on account of the damage. But uh, let's go ahead and pop this thing open, do a little dissection, and see what we can actually find. Oh, it's one of the panels? Yeah, this is definitely one of the LCD panels. It just got absolutely destroyed. I wanna actually go out and test the magnifying capabilities of this. I think that'd be pretty cool. Yeah, I don't even think this one's held onto anything. <gasps> oh, shit. She's exploding. Oh, I found our problem. This ribbon cable popped up. I could probably fix it if I just plug it in. This LCD panel might have made it out unscathed. This looks pretty. I'm just gonna close my eyes and pull. I'm gonna be honest, I don't really see where we burn and I feel like I'm breathing in glass. Yo, I bet you these speakers still work for sh Oh shit, never mind. This one's Well. Uh, that's it. There's only one thing left to do. I'm gonna give it a proper burial. I'm not a monster. It, uh, donated its body to science. I feel like we probably learned... Oh, I feel like we probably learned something out of that, right? Dude, check it out. Strap is still working. Doing, 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 doing. Ow. Ow. Alright, she's all in. I'm gonna be keeping this as a souvenir. 